Welcome to Job Tips, the career development channel. In this video, how to quit your job, how to resign. <laughs> Coming up. Well, you've decided it's time to move on from the company for which you're currently working and do something else. How do you resign gracefully and not burn bridges? Don't burn bridges, right? You might have to cross back over that bridge one day and maybe work for that employer another time. What I recommend doing is don't call them on the phone. Say, it's been great. It's been real. It's been fun, but not real fun. <laughs> not a good idea. Don't do it at the beginning of the day. Don't walk into work and say, you know, I'm going to give you to the end of the day, but when I'm all done, I quit. Wrong-o. To resign gracefully, you should do it at the end of the day with a written nice letter and giving that employer two weeks notice. Be respectful. Give that employer two weeks notice. Now, some employers will just cut their losses and say, that's fine. We'll just say bye-bye now. But you want to take the high road. Give that employer two weeks notice. Remember, you want to leave on very positive terms where the employer knows you know, you're a person of high character and you're going to treat them right because it takes time, oftentimes, to replace a quality individual. So in the letter, you want to say, dear so-and-so, something like, I've enjoyed the time I've spent working for you. It has been a great experience. I appreciate the relationships that we've built along the way. And this experience is something that I will take with me for the rest of my life. And while I'm sad to say this, I have decided to move on to seek other opportunities or maybe to seek opportunities in a different field or what have you. You kind of follow the, the, the point here. My last day in service to your company will be, and put the date, about two weeks from the date of the letter, about two weeks from that date, very respectfully yours and your name. Put that in an envelope. And then at the end of the day, don't just leave it on the boss's desk unless the boss just isn't there. Now, it might be a little more difficult, but this, this assumes that the boss is there at the end of the day or at the end of your shift, at the end of your time in that building that day, walk up to the employer and say, it's been a wonderful experience. I have decided to move on. This is a letter of resignation. Please take the time to read it. I'm not going anywhere for a couple of weeks, but this is the written letter of resignation. Something like that, word it in a very kind, gentle way, even if your boss has been challenging to work for. Because remember, you want to leave on such good terms. If you ever did need to come back, and that does happen from time to time, that employer will welcome you back with open arms. Okay, that's how to resign gracefully. Thank you for watching. I appreciate you so much. Please subscribe to the channel. I would be most appreciative and hit that notification bell so you don't miss any new videos that come out. For job tips, I hope you have or you get the kind of job or career that you want to have.